Hello viewers, this is Judy Takini in my hustle to build a house. Today I want to share with you how I'm living in this unfinished house. This is my house that I started two years ago and already I am inside. So I want to share with you how I'm living in this house. I'm outside and this is my compound. So that's a gate that I just put for protection. It's not permanent. And this is sand and blocks that I brought in to build a septic tank. So I want to go inside so that you can see how I'm living inside this house although it is not finished this is the front veranda i'd used it to put some materials that i'd been using those are bricks and these ones have been used but they remained i'll see what to do with them but later on when they are out it will be cleaner but i'm still using this space as a store so this should be the living room but at the moment i'm using it as a store because i don't have a store so i'm using it to put in any materials which come in this is cement that i'm going to use to build the septic so this is still my store and this is how it is then i want to go to the bedrooms this is a four bedroomed house this bedroom is going to be for my grandkids when they come i want them to be comfortable in kenya we have rural homes and kids always come back during holidays they are always around and that's where my grandkids are going to sleep then this other bedroom is going to be for my two daughters i have two daughters so they will share this bedroom when it is finished at the moment it's not finished you can see that the walls are still not cleaned they're not painted uh, the roof not done and the floor not done then there is a bathroom that they are going to share they will share this is a bathroom that they are going to share now since my living room is a store i decided to take the part which will be the dining area so that i can make it a small living room so this is my living room at the moment things are not done but this is now my living room adjacent to it there is a kitchen this is my kitchen area uh, when it's complete i'll put some cupboards and other things but at the moment this is how it is and this is how i live and this is how i cook inside like you can see i'm cooking rice so that is where i cook that's where i cook and this is where I wash my, my utensils. I draw water from outside and put it in that blue container. Then I use this sufuria as my sink. Then after washing, I'll put them there. This other side is where I put my cleaned utensils and my other things. The kitchen is also not complete. The cupboards are not there, but I will do that soon. Then now I want to go to the other bedroom. This other bedroom is my guest bedroom. I've just put a small bedroom bed so that when I have a guest, uh, they can have a place to sleep. The other day my daughter came and this is where she slept so this is just a bedroom for my guests 
adjacent to it there is a bathroom there is a bathroom adjacent to the guests bedroom then now i'm going to my main bedroom the master bedroom there's going to be a wardrobe here but at the moment i've just put this little cupboard here to put my clothes and my other stuff so this is my bedroom at the moment this is how i sleep and this is my bedroom at the moment so in the bedroom there is a walk-in closet i've not done anything there are no wardrobes no nothing so my things are still my stuff are still stuck in the boxes i cannot remove them because there's nowhere i can put them or i can put them better than the way where they are then i have my bathroom this is going to be my bathroom this is the area that is going to be my bathroom so viewers i kindly ask you to subscribe to my channel so that you can continue seeing how my house will be coming up whenever i'll be doing something new i will be sharing this is a style that so many kenyans are doing so many kenyans are moving into houses when they are not complete and they complete the house when they are inside so subscribe to my channel thank you for viewing and let's meet in my next video